What's up, YouTube? How's it going? It's TJ Houston here, back with another video. So it turns out I found my old TikTok account in which I was thought I was banned from, but I actually banned. And two years later, I see that my account has been recovered. And today, we're just going to be reacting to my old TikTok videos that I made. And let me tell you something. These are my most cringiest TikToks that I made, in which I which I'm never ma making cringy TikToks ever again. Now sit down, relax, get out your snacks, and enjoy the video. So here is my old TikTok account with over 3,000 followers and 1,351 likes. And this was the account that I got banned from since 2020 or 2021, I can't remember. And, and let me tell you this, I tried try for like three months straight to try to recover the account try putting in my password that didn't work try probably uh using another account to try to get this account back but it didn't work and then i also tried also emailing tiktok and giving them a reason why i shouldn't get banned from this account and then tiktok says sorry you can't be, be here no more you're, you're banned you banned i'm sorry and i hope you have a nice day so some of these TikToks got some like uh, music that I had put over these videos and I'm not gonna look at them because for one reason, you know, copyright. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna look at a couple of my TikToks cause I don't plan on looking at all of them. So this video right here was made by a friend of mine. Uh, this was made all the way back in middle school since I was like in seven, I think I was seven, I think I was, uh, I can't remember. I think it was when I was probably uh, in seventh grade. And sorry that the footage was a bit blurry. Uh, he, had, he, the copy didn't come out that good. First, I want to say this: two reasons or two reasons only. Y'all going to be saying in the comments, "Why am I bowling like? Why am I bowling like this?" But like, I know how to bowl. You're supposed to put three. You're supposed to put, you you know, the th three fingers in the hole, and then you swing your arm back, and then. Yeah, you get my point. What I mean. So this video right here was made in my class. So this was my sophomore year and my teachers, so my teacher, he basically told us was, uh, if anybody wants to volunteer to like come up to the book, to come up to the front board and dance to the song. And everybody said no until these two girls volunteered to do it. And you know me, I'm not a pretty good dan dancer and I, I can't even dance. So I, I decided I was to record that video and put it put, and post it on my TikTok page since it was kind of fun, funny. Don't mind that last part right there. Y'all think like she twerking, that she was not twerking. It looked like she was trying to do a little thunderclap with her thighs. So this TikTok right here was made by my first friend, Nason, and this was recorded on the bus, and he sent this video to me, and it was kind of funny, and I, I did not know what, what this th thing was about called called sausage and I think I know what it means it's basically nah I'm not I'm not going to explain it but this but he made this on the bus so I think they were probably rap rapping I could not tell what they were doing wait hold up Oh, hold on. 
<laughs> Wait, hold up. I'm a black Negro and I still get sausage. I feel like that's kind of nasty. That. Bro. This one right here was, I can't remember that day, but that was still like sophomore year. So there was like uh, this military coming from, I don't know, whatever. Uh, I think it was the Navy. I, I can't remember. But this was uh, some little challenge that they set up to see like who can do the most pull-ups. I I I, I really want to try to like do the pull-ups, but nah, I I never. But nah, I'm not str strong enough to like li lift myself up and do like even like one pull-up. I couldn't even do like e even like twelve. <laughs> He only did three pull-ups. Pull Listen, if you are strong enough, I know what some of y'all probably do at least like t 10 to like 20 pull-ups a day, but but basically y'all probably only do like at least like only like five pull-ups. Y'all couldn't could even even look yourself up, even if you think you're even that strong. So oh, this one right here, um, so me and my friend, uh, so since I was sitting outside and basically after school, since my mom didn't pick me up around like four o'clock or like five, I can't remember, uh, my friend, uh, told me was if I wanted to like, uh, come with him for like his little track practice and just practice with him for a bit until like probably like, well, when, when, when like my parent was like coming to like pick me up. And this one, we decided was to do a race against each other to see who was actually fast. And let me tell you this, I actually lost this race and I wasn't even in shape, so. How are they not lying? That's Zach and Ryan. <laughs> I think that's pretty sure. Three, two, one, go! Y'all are really dying over here. <laughs> yeah, that last part in the back, we were actually tapped out and we did not have the energy to even run like like we start from, from the starting line we go all the way down to like to where the uh football flagpole is at and we had no more energy we were both tapped out and we didn't feel like running all the way back and i lost and if you look at the comments right here it says my boy my boy z is so slow wait is that near houston maybe and no this my, the school that I go to is not anywhere near near Houston. It's near Pup Town, and then this one says, uh, "I wish I could have cheered for you." Cheer, cheer for me. And they see me look. They see me. See. Once cheer. You want to cheer me on, but you're gonna see me lose. So oh, I can explain this one right here. So if y'all know who Nakai Avocado is, Jesus, Mary, or Joseph, they have nothing to do with you. They've been watching over me this whole time. That's why I'm the most successful mukbanger. <laughs> You're a piece of garbage. <laughs> Listen, I do not watch his videos, and I don't like his videos because he's not. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna show any disrespect to him, but uh so I was sit, sitting upstairs and I saw that so I so I clicked on this video because I was bored and I wanted to see what this video was about. And this video I, I, I couldn't tell like I couldn't actually tell if he was actually being racist or he was just 
doing this just to be funny. Uh, so you see the title. It says some of the angels from Africa in which he's, that's what he's basically singing. To be honest, I felt like that was actually racist, like actually racist. And that's the one way to just go to hell. So this TikTok right here, so basically it was basically just some video, uh, some guy uh, making a video called if Dora was kidnapped. So what I did was I just re-downloaded the footage and so I was to like edit the little green screen in the background and it really did came out really perfect and I wanted to re-upload the video and even though it didn't get a lot of likes because it, the video did belong to this personal owner and I knew I wasn't even going to get a lot of views or likes for this. Kidnapping you. It looks like we're going to have a problema. Problem. The only problem we're going to have is if you don't come home with me tonight. But sir, I'm only 10 years old. That's illegal. Oh, no, senorita, the rules don't apply if you're a cartoon. <laughs> Why don't you have some kids? Which one of these household objects can save my life? Toothpaste, a book, a Glock 18. Correct the midday. It should have been the Glock 18. Swiper, no swiping. Looks like I'm in Peligro. Danger! If you need, really, <laughs> so you're gonna choose Two Face, knowing Two Face is not gonna save you, and he chose Two Face. How are you gonna choose Two Face? And you got a Glock. Like go with the Glock 18. Like you need that. You need the gun in order to save your life. But you went with the two. That, that video cracks me up. Here's a little friend of mine who I grew up playing soccer with and he sent me this bit video on Snapchat and I the vi I didn't get the video even though it's, it's saying Windy Windy Imposter is sus. The imposter is sus. Okay, so I cannot tell whose voice I was in the background. I, I'm thinking he probably edited this whole thing. Like I could not tell if that was him saying uh, when the imposter is sus and then beatboxing in the back. I, I couldn't tell if that was him or probably his brother. I don't know the difference. So here's another TikTok. And this one was very funny. I can't tell if I even actually find it funny because this was made by one of the uh, good creators on TikTok, YouTube. And, and basically, he makes the best skits too. Uh, this sound was from How We Easy. And this one was called When You Catch Your Mom on TikTok. And I decided it was to do the trend myself, even though it didn't get a lot of likes. Your mom? Mom, what are you doing? I'm, I'm, I'm cleaning my phone. Mom, I think you're doing 
Okay, so this sound right here was made by uh, DC5. So uh, I can explain this one. So we all know that situation since like, uh, I, I think 2020 or 2021, 2022, uh, I don't know. But we all were there when we all saw when Chris Rock made fun of Will Smith's wife because of, by calling her G.I. Dane 2, which basically uh, he called, called her bald. And Will Smith goes on stage, slaps Chris Rock, and says, keep my wife's name out your mouth. And even though, I wish that wasn't me. Love you, G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. All right? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I made a bad choice making that TikTok. This last one w was very funny, and I really did not want to make this TikTok, but I wanted to make it anyways because I wanted to make some f funny good TikToks so I can get 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 me some followers if you know what I mean. Dad and the lady answered me. Oh, is that so? I'm home. What's for dinner? Go. Go and never come back. Well, what did I do? Just go. Just go. Never come back. Adios. Sweetheart, that lady that answered you, what did she say? Oh, she said, Your call has been forwarded to an automated voice messaging system. Oh my gosh, are you stupid? <laughs> So oh, there y'all have it. Those were all my cringy little TikToks, and wh whatever you do, do not go and do not follow that account. Cause I, I like I said, I still can't recover that account, and I'm never going and I'm never doing like funny TikToks like those again. But if you guys want me to react to more TikToks, this video has to have over 200 likes. If y'all enjoyed today's video, make sure y'all give it a thumbs up, like, comment, subscribe, and turn those post notifications on whenever I post brand new videos. But until next time, y'all, peace.